Welcome to Harmonia. This video will show how to add any one of the 371 bot corrals to a Harmonia document. The first thing you will want to do is log in using a teacher's account. All the features required for creating content need to be uh, used in the teacher mode. Uh, to make sure you're in the teacher mode, uh, you will notice that the mortar board is highlighted blue. The first thing you'll want to do is go to the file menu and open a new document. Once you've opened a new document, you want to go to the insert menu. From the insert menu, you want to select choose score. Under choose score, you can select any one of the bot corrals. You can look for them by number. You can also search for them by title. You can also search for them by key, and you can search for them by meter. I'm going to select the very first bot corral here and select the insert menu. Once you find uh, your bot corral here, you can go in and edit anything to your liking. You can do any variety of things. All the notes on the page are editable, so I can move this to a four chord. When I do that, you can see that I get an augmented fourth, which is why Bach likely wrote it as four six. Um, but you've got a wide variety of things you can do. Uh, you can also get rid of the 3-6 chord and you can make it a 5 instead. Uh, that's also perfectly fine. There's all sorts of things you can do. Uh, once you've edited it and gotten it to where you want it, you can then take this and turn it into an assessment. So you can add text. So round number one, you can add instructions for homework. And then you click on the actual musical score and go to the assessment tab. From the assessment tab, I'm going to turn this into a Roman numeral analysis exercise. I'm going to select the invert, the convert button. And from here, you can see that the pitches on the page have been grayed out. Students can no longer alter them. And now you have the option of making any sort of changes to create an exercise. For example, if your students are only working with diatonic harmonies and not chromatic harmonies, anything that has a chromatic chord, you can choose to hide those entries. Uh, if you want to unhide something, you can select that here. If you want to show an answer or clear an answer, you can do all of those various things here. The only other thing I would mention is if you click on the very first box, if you click the button that says friendly key that will actually show you the starting pitch. I mean it will start show you the starting key. Uh, if you don't select this then students will be required to type in the starting key a colon and then the first chord in the first box which is essentially what you would be writing if you were doing it with pencil and paper. Uh, once you've gotten it to this point you've added all your directions and anything else you want to include uh, all you have to do is go to the file menu go to save save it as a document and then when you go to the dashboard where all your courses are held uh, you can upload this document and then your students will have access to it there. If you have any other questions, feel free to contact us at contact at iliacsoftware.com. Thank you.